Yeah, folks, we're here in South Natick, Massachusetts at a uh, little public spot um, to get more evidence of our nation's Christian history. Here is a little uh, memorial here to uh, the John Elliot, in reverent memory of John Elliot, born in England 1604, died in Roxbury, that would be now uh, a section of Boston, 1690, lover of God, lover of men, seeker of the Christian commonwealth, who on this spot preached to his friends, the Indians, in their own tongue, the mercies and the laws of the eternal. John Eliot was a real devout Christian, and he was able to publish the very first Bible, I should say the first thing published in the colonies, was the John Eliot Bible, and it was published in the Algonquin language. Interestingly enough, the Algonquins did not have a written language, so uh, John Eliot had to actually teach the Algonquins the alphabet, you know, put his, the Indian lang learning language, the in Algonquin language, put it to alphabet, and teach the Indians uh, how to read their language. And the first thing they read, of course, was the Bible. He was very successful in converting many Indians. The Indians who converted to Christianity would refer to the Bible or to the written word as speaking pages, uh, speaking paper. Again, this is uh, right in a public venue, and right next to, across the way, is uh, the Elliott Church. Sadly, it is a Unitarian Church that no longer preaches the gospel, but this was the location of the first church built by John Elliott and the, uh, the native Indians here in uh, South Natick, Massachusetts.